And can we talk about some of the proposals that for covenants? I, I know what in 2013 or some some Greg Maxwell made a post back in the day. There's been I don't know if that was quite a proposal, more of just an idea. But what proposals currently exist today that are covenant proposals? I guess you could say. Is that for me? All right. So, <laughs> Anyone that wants to answer it. Um, I have a favorite one, uh, which I'll tell you about last. But uh, there are a lot of, I think one thing that's important to understand when we say the word proposal, it means different things. So there is a BIP, which is a Bitcoin improvement proposal. And that is a proposal that is, that is like very structured. And uh, they can be at different levels of readiness. And so when you talk about a proposal, um, there's also a sort of idea. Right, of, hey, what if we did this? So there are a lot right now of what if we did this is. And as far as I'm aware, there's only like one or maybe two things that are kind of more on the side of like, here is a concrete thing that we could do. So in the, the scope of things that are like, here are ideas, people are talking about what if we added like a language that itself in scripting was maybe you know, like a Lisp or some sort of like actual programming language to Bitcoin, then we could compute any arbitrary covenant we ever could want. We could say all the possible covenants we could express. That's something people are thinking about, but nobody has like a code sample that you could run and try with. And then um, there are some maybe like application specific covenants that are like rather than this big general purpose thing, like what if we just had a covenant that let us manipulate a tap script and manipulate the tree that we've seen there's one called Tap Leaf Update Verify that people are getting maybe a little excited about. There are some other ones people have talked about as well, but all those things are kind of in the space of, hey, I've got a cool idea, don't know exactly what it would look like. Um, the, the two that have uh, some potential for covenants that are in the more concrete phase where it's something maybe that could be considered for merging uh, and activation at some point in the next like, year or two would be Check Template Verify, which is the proposal that I work on and any prev out, which is one that is in the Lightning community primarily, but has applications for covenants that are not, like if you said we can remove covenants from any prev out, the Lightning community probably would do it because they're focused on it for a different application, so sort of a side effect. Um, and so for check template verify, um, I, I like covenants, and I think that generally covenants you know, are, are something we should explore, but a lot of people in the community, like Greg Maxwell in this original post where he shared it, had a lot of reservations around are covenants good? Are they bad? Can they have bad, you know, bad things happen? And so when I designed CTV in 2019, uh, I said, can I make a covenant that is the simplest possible thing that, that basically if you don't want CTV, then you will not want any covenant system ever, at least in terms of functionality. Maybe you'll disagree from a product management point of view. But if you say CTV is bad, here's why CTV is bad, then we can rule out all covenants forever. But if you're like, CTV is good, like, well, we'll get something done maybe, and then we can talk about the more sophisticated things. So, so it's like CTV is like the smallest unit of Covenant where it's like, hey, if we can prove that this is bad, then we know Covenants are bad. But if this is good, there might be more opportunity. Yeah, so, like, I, I think that's how I would describe it. And yeah. just in terms of, you know, like the doneness of the proposal, it, it is in a form where, like, you could merge, activate, and release it, you know, starting now if you wanted to. So it's more in the category of product management decision rather than there's still an engineering question around how would we actually implement this thing.